What's happening, you guys? How you doing? Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you. Today we're going to be, I guess, going a little bit off-center and playing a new game. It has overwhelmingly positive reviews, an early access game. It's called Timberborn, where you're uh, basically playing like a beaver, or a bunch of beavers, and you uh, you build things. Um, and I'm reading my Discord right now, and... Let's let, let's let me uh, let me go over some of the things in the Discord um, before I before I start. As I'm telling people this, they're telling me that probably should have gone over the tutorial, but that's not me. So uh, we'll see what happens. Hopefully, I will like. Uh, hopefully, I should be okay. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. I don't I don't know what to think about it. To be honest with you, what's up, little Ash? Little, you love this game. Well, hopefully, you can uh, you can kind of like uh, push me a, a, around and show me a little bit of things and help me get me on the righteous path if you know what I'm saying. Radio, radio, what's happening? Michelle, my one Facebook viewer, Diamond Wop in. It's good to see all you guys. Let's uh, let's go ahead and just jump right in. New game, choose your choose your uh, your faction. Folktales. Easy going but hard working. Folktales are expert farmers. They respect nature and rewards them with plenty uh, plentiful bounties. Their motto, comfort, food, and sturdy wood. Okay? Iron teeth, defectors of the traditional timber wolves. They uh, mastered iron and science to build advanced machinery. They achieve progress through ingenu ingenuity. Can lack reach average well-being of 15. Okay, so we can't play these guys. This is this is an early access. All right, well we'll go with those guys. And we don't have a choice, so whatever. Beginner friendly. These day days, rich areas and rich in lakes and rivers are scarce. What little remains shows that there's still hope for Earth, though. With expansive areas as flat as the beavers tell, this uh, region makes for a safe testing ground for novice engineers. It's an old parenting trick to tell kits that I guess a kid is a beaver, right? Weird. If the music's too loud, let me know. It's an old parenting trick to tell kits that a waterfall is just a big floodgate. Here they'll spend weeks learning to looking for a shutoff lever. You can do a drunk. I heard they changed the water collection and some stuff. I don't know the new stuff, and I won't be able to help. Sorry. No worries, man. KBK none. Drag dragging us. What's happening, man? Little girl. I was right. No, it's 3D Realm World. Maybe. We'll see. I mean, do they have, like, um, war crimes and stuff? I have a feeling they won't. Let's just go with, uh, we'll go with planes, because that, that sounds beginner friendly. We can kind of learn uh, novice engineering and all sorts of stuff. We'll also go easy. You're still learning or want a relaxed city building experience. What's normal? Your city starts, settlement starts with moderate resources. Droughts and bad tides are milder at the beginning, but intensify over time. That's fine. We'll go with normal. We'll just be some normal beavers. Just some normal beavers doing what beavers do. We sing songs? Beaver crimes, I know, right? If a building is marked as solid, such as a lodger or a warehouse, you can build other structures on its roof. Okay, what would you like to call yourself? We'll, we'll call ourselves, uh, Drunk's Domain. Welcome to the tutorial. We'll help you with all the basics. All right. Every new settlement needs logs. Only lumberjacks will cut trees. So place two lumberjack flags next to the trees. Okay. I need to come right here. Let's see. Lumberjack flag. Right there. I guess I need to do another one, right? There we go. Perfect. Let's continue. The flags will not be built unless they are in the district's uh, building range. Uh, select the district center to see which, see its building range. You can extend it by building paths, okay? Where's the water anyway? Maybe here? We'll do it right here. It's too far from the district, okay? I can do it right here though. Yeah, we'll do it right here. Wonder why it's not building.
Ah, I see. I see. Okay. I just build them all over the place. Oh, wait a minute. Can I move this? Look to see how far you can build without the paths. Okay, so um, I can build all the way over here. Can I move this? By building paths. So I need to build paths. Let's see. Where where are the paths? District managers, storage, landscaping, paths. There we go. Ah, got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, so I need to I need to do that as well. Building lots of paths. How do I, um, can I, can I delete this? Let's see. Yeah, I can't delete it. Start this over here. Let's do, let's try this again. Need to be near water to keep your beaver moist. Well, um, so I need to go, I guess, over here then? Let me see. Yeah, see, I got it right here, so I can build a path for, I can do it right here, maybe? It's saying zero of two. What's happening? Need to be near water to keep your your uh, beavers w w moist. Uh, th this is water, right? Right here. I'm assuming it is. Okay, so we we should be able to do it, right? Look, it's in it's it's within the the uh, thing, so I could should be able to like stick a a flag, a lumberjack flag. Maybe right here. It's really weird, right? The arrow has to connect to the path. Got it. Okay. Let's do this.
Oh, wait a minute. That's the reason. It was on pause. Son of a bitch. I wasn't even paying attention. I was like, why isn't, why isn't it working? It's because I was on pause. Was like, this is dumb. All right. Conundrum number one taken care of. Hurry up, beavers. Do what you do your thing. <laughs> Have you ever seen a beaver? Beavers are pretty big. I was like actually like um Oh cool, we can continue now. Every building with an entrance must be connected to the district center by a path. Be aware that uh, district centers have a limited range, but uh, build paths connect the lumberjack flags to the district center. You can select the district center to see its range along with the paths. Okay, we've already gotten that. Lumberjacks will not start working until you tell them what to do. Use the cut trees to mark an area for cutting. The lumberjack flag can only cut trees within its range. You can check. Okay, so we need to come right here. So we were, I was at a place called Shelby Farms with my dogs. With, well, it was actually my one dog. And we were walking through, like, it's, it was like a dog park, right? With lots of ponds or whatever. And out of this, like, I don't know, it was not in the water. It was, like, out, out of the water. It was, like, this giant rodent with a flat, uh, I mean, it, it went, it, it, man, that thing went. It was, like, fast. Okay, I marked the trees for cutting. Need a water to survive. Build a water pump to ensure a continuous source of drinking water. Remember to connect it to to a city a district center. Okay, so we can do a water pump maybe down here. Let's see. Like right here, maybe. We'll do it right there. Beavers are kind of fun. One of the most aggressive neutral uh, neutral animals in that they aren't too friendly or hostile to humans. Man, that thing took off like a dart. My dog, who's like really fast, she was like a lab, but she was like, you know, one of these labs that likes to, to catch frisbees and balls and stuff and could like fly. She, uh, she, she took off after that thing. Thought she was going to catch it. Wolf 22, what's happening? Are they doing stuff? I can't tell if they're doing stuff or not. Waiting for materials, okay. Do I need a path for this too? Does the path need to come over here? Okay, no it doesn't. We're good. Water pump's gonna be built in no time at all. Look at this, look at these little beavers walking around. All right, water pump's done. In addition to water, beavers also need food. Build a gatherer flag near the blueberry, uh, near some blueberry bushes. Okay, so there's there's some right there. Um, let's go ahead and get a path going over this way. I think. Let's see. Yeah, we're gonna need a path. We'll just extend it all the way down this way. There we go. Perfect. I need a I need a a blueberry things because that's what they like gatherer flag. There we go, perfect. Uh, is that what that little little icon says? That's fine. There we go. Now it's connected. My little beavers will be uh, be eating and uh, drinking in no time. A glorious post-apocalypse beaver civilization shall be created around our glorious river. The age of men have come and gone. Now is the age of the beaver. Early access to it. This has actually got like a overwhelmingly positive, like 21,000 uh, reviews. Whenever that happens, you know, you got to look at it and go, Jesus, look, in this right here, we can actually, uh, 
looks like, what is that? A blockage. We could actually demolish that and like actually get water going over this way. How about that for cool? Settlement needs a stable food source. Build a farmhouse to plant and harvest crops. If you are running low on workers, you can pause some buildings to do so. Select a building and click the pause button. Okay, so where am I going? I need uh, something. Plant trees and bushes right here. Food. Efficient farmhouse. We'll stick it right here. That's the ultimate in efficiency. See, it's right next to our gatherers. They can just wander over here to the farm. All right, let's see what, what's up here. We have eight beavers, eight adults, and four children. Occupied beds. We need to get them beds. We're gonna have to get. We're gonna have to build beds. Let's see what else. Beavers, workplaces, blah blah blah. Science, materials, ingredients, food, logs, water. Why is the thirst up up here? Oh, they're sleeping right now. Got to wake up. Day one. We've, we've already gotten a lot of stuff done. See, our beavers are gathering now. The farmhouse is moving. I can't afford all these new new great games like Helldiver. I spent all my money on a new high-end computer. I, hey, Seamus, I know all that, all about that. I, I spent all my money on a real high, high-end high computer about a year and a half ago, two years. Which means I'm probably going to have to spend all my money on another high-end high -end deal um, in a... Uh, in a couple more years. All right, cool. Farmers will not start working until you tell them what and where to plant. Use the plant crops to mark a carrot field. Okay, plant crops. All right, here. All right, they need to be irrigated, so, hmm. I'd probably say right here. We'll build a path that way. I'm assuming this is going to work out okay. Go ahead and demolish that as well. I might be getting ahead of myself, but that's all right. There we go. Now we got water. Water right next to it. Perfect. This reminds me, my first check was deposited last night at midnight a few days early. Very nice, Sagnuts. Uh, small point, it was a tax write-off. Yeah, it, that's, that's, a, that's a probably a pretty big point, actually, right? It's like a $6,000 computer. Do I not have enough? Is that the problem? That's exactly what the problem is. 88. There we go. While all the buildings you, you place have some storage, they will fill up quickly, build additional stockpiles for logs and water. Each storage building can hold up to one type of resource. Hold, only hold one type of resource. You can set it after selecting the building. Okay, we can build a large pile. This will build, build a large pile over here. Where is it? Right here. Storage. There's a large pile. Yeah. 
build a small tank. Okay, we'll build a small tank over here. No! Why aren't they doing anything? Oh, they're waiting for materials. Oh, you know what? It's because I probably need to, to uh, zone more, more areas, right? needs no dumb I don't need any dumb tutorial look at this I'm doing fine cinnamon night what's happening confused beard is good to see you does the uh, flag affect the amount of lumber workers if yes you might want to place a third flag maybe Yeah, you're probably right. It does, doesn't it? All right, we need another flag. Where's the water? Oh, is that a small warehouse? Doggone it. Why'd I do that? Nice beaver. What's up, Bullet Bait? So tomorrow, I'm I, I probably am going to take the day off tomorrow and go to Costco. I'm, I need to go to Costco Sunday, but I felt so sick after playing that one game that I, I just didn't do it. So, so I got to figure out like whether it's going to be tomorrow or uh, Friday, and I haven't decided. Build that thing. There we go. Little water. There we are. I gotta build I gotta build several tanks. Okay. Let me see. There's two. I'll go one right over here. Just order hello, Costco. Well, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I'm just warning you guys ahead of time because I, I might end up uh, reneging on that and like actually and actually uh, working. I might not. It just really depends. Where are my beavers sleeping at night? I read it the I read it that you can buy a car through Costco and deliver it to your home state. Yes, you can you can do all sorts of stuff through Costco. 
It's it's probably my favorite place. Uh, like ever, what's going on here? There's no water in any of these places. Probably need a pump over here as well, don't I? Come on, come on, beavers. Time to time to build. How can I tell how much wood I have? Is it right here? I oh, just well being. Okay, thirty two wood. Okay, how much wood does this take? Fifteen. Look at he's humping the tree. Bad beaver. Oh no, he's not. He's just eating it. There we go. Perfect. With logs and water having a place to store, you should prepare the same for berries and upcoming carrots to harvest. Build a medium warehouse. What is this right here? It's a small warehouse. Okay, so I need to build build a medium warehouse. Hmm. Starting to run out of places. Maybe I'll build one right here. We got to build two of them. One for carrots and one for berries. Kind of want to come over here. Although this looks like this might be an okay place too. Maybe right here. Just tear down the small one, maybe. Will, will I get stuff back for it if I tear it down, though? Three wood, okay. Beautiful. So we need one for carrots. So this will be for our carrots. Berries, bread, carrots. There's there's one for carrots. How's our water coming along? We have zero water in there. Son of a bitch. One for berries. Come on, beavers, get to work. Don't be afraid to get your face wet, I know, right? The toilet paper conundrum. I actually have to get, like, uh, other things. I have to get protein powder because, you know, I'm now, like, officially, like, you know, uh, an athlete because I, I go to the gym every day. So I need to go. I need to to get some uh, some protein powder for myself. And I, when I say protein powder, I don't mean insure. Okay, that's for old people. And I have to get some saline solution for my eyes. Cool. Science points are used to unlock more advanced buildings. An inventor will produce science points over time. Build an inventor. Okay, so I need to come right over here to science. She blinded me with science. Bop bop bop. Let's see where we're going to stick this thing. Let's we'll stick it over here near the, the city center. Girly boy. <laughs> Come on, man. Can I can I now move my, my pathways a little bit closer? Maybe so. Let's see. I need to build myself a little path. Come all the way across here. Ah, it's not going to let me build the path. Kind of, sort of, but not really. I guess they don't really need paths for this. All right, that's as far as it, it can go.
Do, do the trees grow back? I hope they do. Cool. So we got science points. Homes increase the beavers' well-being and allow your folks' population to grow. Build enough lodges to house all your beavers. Okay. A mini lodge, which will do one. How many beavers do we got? We got 11 beavers. Other buildings can be built, built on top of this. What about this one? They can build it on top of that. Or a triple lodge. That's 250. Oh, I need science points for that, don't I? I just got to do one lodge. That's four. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. 10, 11. Oh, wait a minute. I only need him six. Son of a bitch. I'm not paying attention, man. I need to, I need to put on my paying attention brain. Don't forget your soy milk, soy boy. Gold bond powder on account of my uh, swamp ass. Oh, that's the worst. You know, if if you're if you're ever like if you have swamp ass and you have to worry about it, like you know, you really all you need all you really need is baby powder, talcum powder. You can put flour on that shit too. Just a little heads up in case in case you were wondering. I'm sure you weren't, but you could. Cool. All my beavers are gonna be nice and happy. Butt bread, I know, right? Anything that like soaks up that moisture and stuff, man. Cause swamp ass is a serious thing. It can really mess you up. I'm just saying. I gotta wait for these trees to grow, I guess, huh? What is this up here? It's a birch, okay. Oh, it died. Never mind. Oh, it probably died because there's no water. Still no water in this. Already urbanizing with highly concentrated homes. I want them all to be together, man. You know what I mean? Let's stay together. <laughs> it's very important for my beavers to be together and have like a closeness and stuff, you know? We're, we're social creatures. We're not out humping trees like that guy right there. We're trying to talk to each other. We're trying to have beaver babies and stuff. And this guy's going to town. How far? Wow, he can go all the way that all the way over there. That's amazing. Can you br do bridges yet? Might be worth going further uh, a field for for wood. Yeah, I don't think we can do bridges just yet. A uh, six. Okay, let's see what else. We can now start producing more advanced resources, but some buildings require power to do so. Build a water wheel by the shore on the river. It's dependent on the water. Okay, so where where is the water? Right, right here. I could probably build one right here, right? Like this right here. Your beavers are happier than ever. They have reached a new well-being high score of four. All right, let's see if that will work. And Shammer was born. Benny has grown up. Zarajas has grown up. Hot Hokima has grown up. And Sa Zasha. Zashi. Yeah, I kind of figured you need to, I need to, to irrigate that. So what I'll probably do is like maybe, I don't know. I don't know how I, I'm going to get to there, but. Yeah, that's dead land. I can see it. Gonna take 50 wood and we have 14.
I don't not enough science points, so I can't do that just yet. I'm just gonna have to I'm just gonna have to deal with what I got. How much science points do I have? You'd think I'd be able to see my science points, right? It's somewhere. Oh, 39 right there. Okay. Expand the logging to the rest of those trees. If not, all of them are in the logging area, I think. Yeah, so, so my logging area is expanded to right there. So I guess I can, uh, maybe I can build a, uh, let's, let's build a pathway. Still not close enough. Doggone it. That tree's all in my way. We'll just have to wait. Why is it so dry? I don't know. Kind of reminds me of Banished. Been a long since I played that game. Yeah, this this is this has like a, a lot of those hallmarks. There, there's a there's a game that's not not similar to this. I mean, it's similar in the fact that it's a city builder builder that I really enjoy called Settlement uh, Survival Settlement. I think that's what it Settlement Survival or something like that. I really really enjoy that game, but it's uh, um and it's an early access too. And I think I'm th trying to think of who plays Raptors really big into that game. He wants to uh, play that game. He, he plays that game pretty religiously. Whenever they have a new update or whatever, it's been it's been several months since I played it. Might have to revisit that. Now I'm wondering if this is if it's getting aired because of, of this. I, I could probably. Uh, Cool, we, we, we almost got this going. I wonder if, can I, can I irrigate this? Landscaping. Double floodgate. That's going to show me how to do it. Drunk, what are you doing to dry out the, those beavers? So I don't know, Sagnuts. What am I doing? It does seem like it's kind of growing, doesn't it? How's my water pump doing over here? Productivity is uh, is 68%. I bet I can't add another person. Is this, is this working now? It is. Perfect. It's time to start producing planks. Build a lumber mill and connect it to the water wheel with power shafts. All right. Let's see what, it, what I need to do here. Okay. So I need to go to here and get a lumber mill going. That'd be right here. And then I needed power sh shafts. What is it? A straight power shaft. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. T section.
need to connect to the center of the wheel, okay? I'm lurking while working, but this reminds me why Anona's got herself a big brown beaver and she shows them all to her friends. Indeed, Primus. Dead Eye Dicks, thank you so much. Member for, uh, for 20 months. My goodness, my friend. Thank you. All right, this, this looks like this is going to be, like, super complicated. That's a power shift T. I'm not exactly sure what. Oh, maybe it comes. Does that work? Move the, remove the last section and select the right angle. Okay, let's do it. Right angle. Rotate it once. Which one? This right here? Like that? Trying to figure it out here. Easier just to, to just turn the wheel. What's up, Yozy? All right, let's see if they'll, they'll build this and then we'll figure out that, which works here. But is the wheel blocking the uh, towel next to it from any construction? I think so. Do I need to like build like maybe uh, like terraform this a little bit? Because it needs to come up to right here, right? It needs to come to right here, right? Or one or either side. How do I do that? Uh 
Ah, shit. It looks like I'm gonna have to gonna have to break it and rebuild it. Like right here, right? Does that work? One to the most left on power. Where to the most left? The other one to the left. So it's not... I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Like right here. Is that right? Ah, got it. Like that. Perfect. There we go. There we go. We'll have this in no time. What, what kind of wheel was that? Oh, it's a power wheel. Only beavers are allowed to work in this workspace. Beaver operated back sor backup source of power. Okay, got it. So it looks like drought's going to be a problem. Maybe we can get this building. There's there's almost no flow in that spot. Do I was I supposed to like look for a flow? How can I tell where the flow is? I see what you're saying. I would have probably been better off coming out down here. Maybe you can make a corridor to force the water through to, or maybe a dam. Maybe so. Well, I mean, it didn't tell me this in the tutorial. You know what I mean? It's not like, hey, you know what? You need to, like, you need to, like, pay attention to this stuff, you know? You need to pay attention to the water flow. It didn't tell me that. It just said, it said, it's time to start producing planks. Build a lumber mill and connect it to the water wheel with the power shafts. That's what it told me. What's up, Gremlin? How you doing? Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you.
Man, this stuff is encroaching. Don't put water wheel in pond. It didn't say that. It just said, hey, you know what? You need to build a water wheel. Build it. You know what I mean? That's all I heard. We're just waiting for materials now. We're waiting for the trees to grow. <laughs> Like, well, it sure be nice if we could uh, grow some more trees. Can I build a, uh, maybe a, I don't know, like, um, what else can I build? 70. I could do this. Yeah, we're going to build it. We're going to build the, uh, go ahead and build this right here. And then I'm going to go ahead and get my paths and structures. I guess I gotta wait. What is this right here? A lumberjack flag. I don't need that. There we go. Perfect. Finally. We need a stable source of logs. Unlock the forester and uh, build it near a place you want to plant trees. Okay, so we need a forester next. Guess we'll, we'll build it right here. Ah, hellfire. I just used all my points. I'm going to have to wait. <laughs> Son of a bitch. That's what I get for uh, for unlocking points. I, I thought I was like, hey, you know what would be great? Let's build a uh, let's build a, build a staircase. That'd be awesome. What happens? I fuck myself up. Stupid tutorial. Come on, man. You Come on, Beaver. You need to, to, to hurry up with that 60 points. Drought's a serious thing. <laughs> 50 points. Come on, baby. Come on, Beavers. I'm fast forwarding. It's going as fast as it can, man. Oh, maybe it's not. Yeah, it is. It's going as fast as it can. We need to get the science going. Fifty-two. Fifty-three. 54 Mississippi, 55 Mississippi, 56 Mississippi. But we can do it here in just a second. I'm glad I didn't spend all of my stuff. There we go. Build it, baby. Build the forestry. Drought is upon us and we are entirely unprepared. I'm just through the fucking tutorial. Why would they throw a, a drought on me? This isn't Rim World. What kind of shenanigans is this? A little beaver colony. Oh, I need planks too. Is this building planks? All right, so what's going on here? It was working and then it wasn't. Rimworld is much easier, exactly. Uh, 
Oh, the water flow is coming. It is it, well, that sucks. This can't be good. I mean, is there is there a better place for me to build a water wheel? Ah, hellfire. Good thing is we got some carrots stored. How much water do we have anyway? 21. Well, wow, there's no water. Well, at least my people are still happy. They're a four. Their well-being is a four. They only have one person with broken teeth. Got lots of carrots. They're happy. We're out of water now. Oh, really? So, or is everybody about to start dying? I mean, there's really not much I can do about it, right? Well, they're happy. They're, they're, your beavers are happier than ever. They've reached a new well-being high score of five. So we should have probably uh, pulled as much water as we could possibly get, huh? For the drought. Look for a water source. Yeah, there's no water. This game has fucked me. Yeah, there's no water. There's no water around. Up, oh, negative, negative one. We just need to get through what? Two days? Two more days of this? 1.1 1. 1 day left. We can, we can get through this. We can get through this, baby. We can get through this. Come on, baby. Beavers are like, where the fuck is the water, man? I mean, I've done nothing wrong in this tutorial. I don't think I have. Oh, maybe I fast forwarded. That was a problem. 0.7 days. Are people going to start dying now? Point six days. No one's died yet. But we have some very unhappy beavers. Put the pump in the highest priority, so it's the first thing you, you run after the drought. Okay. Is the water going to ever come back?
Before researching ahead. Okay. When is the water going to come back? And how do I do this for highest priority? There we come. Here it comes. Thank goodness. We're gonna do another water pump. I'm not gonna get I'm not gonna get fucked up again. Choose the choose the uh, plant trees and bushes tool and and plant and and plant some pines. Okay, so where what do I need to choose from? Pines right here. We'll slow it down. They're still all, all mad because we have no water. We had two children. We, we, we're still okay. Your settlement now is self-sufficient as long as the water keeps flowing. Consider building a dam or placing more tanks to, to help your beaver survive the droughts. All right, so we, we, we've done that. We've got this. I need... I n Probably... Go ahead and get a pathway going over here. Though you said draft, I know, right? <laughs> oh God! So what do we do now? Probably need to build a. What would a, what will a dam do? We build a bridge, maybe. Take advantage of this over here. I just built something too much. Solid other buildings can be built on top of this. We could actually build a platform on this, but we're, we're, we just accidentally did a uh, a one by one uh, bridge. We're gonna have to wait. What could possibly go wrong here?
Will it, will it potentially flood us out? Is that a potential? I'm just curious. Abba! Abba! Dancing queen! <laughs> What's happening? It's too far to just and cannot be reached by builders. Build more paths. Okay. Weird, it's not going to let me do it. Can it get too wet? I don't know. It, apparently, I can't. I, I can't really build a dam right here. But we're back to being happy. That's good. I'm just wondering why I can't go, like, I can go up here. Doesn't look like even with a path, I'm not going to have any pathway to get over on this side. Which is kind of, kind of a shame. See, it kind of cuts off. More trees. Where do I need to do more trees at? So you're saying I need more of these, right? We'll do more trees here. Let's see, metal, wood. Let's see, where's the planning? He built this city on rock and roll. Jonah, what's happening? How you doing? You need a lot of trees. Okay, so we're going to build like more trees over here, I guess. Fair enough. I really need this to work. I guess I, I guess I was like just like poor planning on my part. I wonder if I do it over here if it if it would be better. Build another water wheel.
what is this right here it is a lumber mill so we, we're gonna do a lumber mill here i think i might get a little bit more power out of this right how can i tell 135 hp cms this is getting nothing but it, it seems like this would be a, a better deal right focus on the water uh storage and damming right now okay So drunk two hours into this, you think in the positive reviews, two hours already? It's only one hour into this. But to go, wow, man, that, that just flew right by. I think it's, I, I think it's pretty good. I need to, I want to dam. I, I guess what I need to do is I need to uh, dam some of this part right here, right? It's gotten like really, really good reviews for sure. So it's saying to build more uh more stuff or a new district. I don't know how to how to do that, to be honest with you. It's not giving me any 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 shot as far as what I need to do. Terrain block, an artificial block of terrain. Other buildings must be uh can be can be built on top ground only must be built on the ground. See, it's telling me it's too far from my district. But see, the problem is is that my district, as you, as you can see, it doesn't cover the water, which is weird. Because if you want to uh, build a dam, you just need more wood for the dam. Well, it's not its not letting me do anything. Let's see, levy. It's, it's basically this right here. Look, it's telling me that can't get all the record. Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, so we need more wood. I think once we dam this up, it'll create pressure, right? Yeah, an hour, hours in, it's it's okay. I've, I've just finished the tutorial, and now I'm like trying to figure out everything else. It's not. It's so far. It's it's challenging enough. It's not like brutally like like brutal. Like I have no idea what I'm doing. Um. But it's it's challenging enough for me to like uh, worry about worry about stuff. What do I need for this again? I just need logs. Okay. Great regression. What's happening? Morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you. They need some morning wood. All right, I'm gonna stretch my legs, you guys. What is this right here? So we're we're at forward at a forward happiness, our well being. We have sixteen uh sixteen adults, five children. 21 occupied beds, three free beds, zero are homeless, so that's fine. I have five that are unemployed, so we're not maximizing our stuff. I wonder if there's a way to do that. Get that good stretch going on. Yeah, I wouldn't. I, I have, I've been like, I'm on my third day of uh, of working out for the week, and I'm feeling great, man. I'm feeling great. Been running those five Ks every day, you know, five Ks, and I've been doing uh, lunges. It's been, uh, you know, to get the testosterone up because I am an old guy. I need that, and, and and at this point, I can say that I'm an athlete because I, I go to the gym, and that how, how it works. I'm gonna stretch my legs, y'all.
I'm going to grab some more water, too. We need to make some more water storage. Hundred and twenty. We'll go ahead and get another small tank going. Pick one up here. I'm gonna do another one right here. Can I? Can't? Can't get get by without any more water, right? Quads hand workouts are so good for uh, buffing the tea. Shalom. Yeah, exactly. Gym flex. You know. I mean. Hey, you know what? I'm running five Ks, and I'm I've actually. I'm actually got to the point where I'm I can like uh like I'm doing uh basically three miles and like right at thirty minutes, which doesn't sound like a lot, but it's a lot for me. So I'm feeling I'm feeling stronger and better and more more alive than ever. What so once we get once we get this dam this dam built up, and I'm assuming that the, that you know what we probably need tree cutters, don't we? I'm sitting here like uh, not really fucking with this and. Yeah, I think I need I need tree cutters. Let's let's go ahead and, and, and do that. I might have uh screwed the pooch here. There we go. I cut off all my, my tree cutters and we're gonna we're gonna expand this out a little bit more. Damn, it seems I missed a lot, but better late than never, I think they are. Well, you know, the way I look at it, right, is once you get, if, you, if you're if you not taking care of yourself, right? And I mean, I've, I've done this with keto, too. You know, I've talked about this. I'm not going to talk about keto, though. But if you're not taking care of yourself, it, it's, it's, it, you're, you're basically, when you're, when you're younger, if you're not taking care of yourself, right? You're, you're not banking on stuff. You're going to wind up like all fucked up when you get older. I'm just telling you, it's the truth. It's the truth. You wind up with all sorts of diseases that you have that you probably shouldn't have even bothered having, um, and it's tough. Yeah, we got 97 water now. I'm gonna do one more pump, I guess. Maybe right here. Beautiful. Now, are they going to cut these trees down eventually? Is that what's going to happen next? I just didn't put a bunch of bunch of trees in here for this just to be sit here, just to sit here and do nothing. Plant them all, baby. Just be really careful about not falling at this stage. All it takes is one good fall to wreck what little time you, you still have left. Oh, it's John Sagan. Shut the hell up. You don't know. You don't know. I'm I'm fit as a fiddle, baby. I ain't gonna break my hip anytime soon. I love how all, all you young people like 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 to razz me about this stuff. Plant those trees, beavers. We've been alive for 10, 10 days. Let's go ahead and build some more water stuff.
If I broke my hip, I would never recover, and I'm not 40 quite yet. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Although I'll tell you what, you know, I was, I, I was, wor you know, I, I, I see people like, um, like, I, my clientele at my work, I, I see people, the same people all the time, right? So I have this couple that's older. They, they come in and they like, uh, they, they, they're nice. I mean, they're really nice. No, and, and anyway, I, I, I literally, I saw him like three months ago and he came in like last week and he was like, my wife died. And I was like, what? I was like, how is that possible? I mean, obviously I know how it's possible, but I was like, I, was like, I can't believe that. How'd that happen? And he said that she broke her hip. She fell. She fell in the house, broke her hip, and it was like pretty much all over from that point on. Like she she was just like, she was done. She was done. She had physical therapy and then she died. That's basically what happened. Like that's terrible. Are they not going to cut any more trees down? Or what's going on here? Yeah, that's exactly. And you know, when I was uh, when I was doing um, like A and P biology and stuff, um, that's one of the things that they talked about was uh, the fact that people uh, break their like like. You know what? Let's. Uh, I'm 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 tired of waiting. We're we're gonna build some more pathways here. We can get some more more stuff. We have one free bed yet. Oh, fuck, another drought. How much water do we have? Just harvest the dead trees. I don't know if you can. You harvest those. I don't think you can harvest them. Honestly, the childrens are gonna die. It's all right. That means it'll be nobody will be homeless. But it would be nice for us to have a little bit more water than what we have. We have 118. All right, so can we not like? I mean, why? Why are my? Why is my shit not not uh, replant dead trees? Not marked for cutting? Okay, we'll we'll do that right there. But I don't really understand why uh, this isn't working. Like like the trees aren't getting cut. The seedling right there, seedling. They're all seedlings. That's probably the reason. Indeed, the more fit you are while you're young, and if you don't have bad eating habits, then old age is better most times. Yes, that's that's exactly right. Now, obviously, you can you can die from other things, you know, cancer and all that stuff. You can die from the COVID and you know pneumonia and and like uh, AIDS and all sorts of creepy crawly type stuff. But I mean, for the, for the most part, if you're if you're somewhat healthy, we got 148 uh, points now. What else can we do here? We can build a platform. We can build buildings on top. I don't know if I want to unlock this.
1,000. Oh, we can do like a, look at this. We can make like a rooftop terraces and stuff and teeth grindstones. And a shower. Oh, you can do all sorts of stuff. But we have a drought coming, so we don't want to we don't want to mess around with that. It's coming in one point one point uh, seven days. We have ninety one water. I'm just I wish we could we had more, but we can't do anything. And I wonder if this seedling is going to die on us. You can get killed by walking your doggy, or is he by walking your doggy? How does he say that? He says it. He says it funny. And when, you know, like when uh, Pacino also goes, she's got a big ass. <laughs> he, that's one of the best movies ever. I love that movie. That's one of those movies that the, um, the, the bank robbery scene, when GTA uh, came out with that, uh, they have, they have one that's real similar to, to what happened in Heat. I was just blown away by that. I thought that was just like the coolest thing ever. <laughs> and you got your head all the way up it. Yeah, that, that's 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 one of my favorite movies. I was like watching Reddit. They were asking like, what movies could you watch over and over again? I would say that would be one of the movies. Um, as far as like newer movies, Godfather and Godfather Two, I can watch those all day long. Uh, there will be blood. Is another one. What's his face? Daniel Day Lewis is just fucking incredible. He's just such a good actor. That'd be a, another one. Um, there's a couple other ones. Um, what is the movie with uh, with the FBI agent and um, it has Leonardo DiCaprio and uh, oh gosh, um, Jack Nicholas in it? I'm trying to remember from Boston. Such a good movie. My wife like gets so annoyed with me. She's like, "That's all. That's that's all you can." Uh, she's like, "You watching that again?" I'm like, yeah, there's nothing else on. Goodfellas, yeah, Goodfellas is another one. Heat, Big Lebowski's great. Aliens is awesome. God, what is that movie? Departed, yeah, The Departed. That's a really good movie too. But yeah, my wife, my wife like really freaks out. She's like, "Why are you watching this?" You're watching this again. Have you not? Have you not seen it? You know, like a gazillion times. Are my saplings like? How long is this going to take? It takes 12 days, and it produces two wood. So you're you're right. I am going to need a lot of wood, aren't I? All right. Let's let's get this over with. Come on, drought. Mac and me. I, I, I've, I've never... Uh, what is Mac and me? I don't think I've ever... Mac and Ma. What is that? True Romance is a good one, too. Although I don't know if, it's, if it if it's quite, sits quite as high with, uh, with those other movies. Apocalypse Now? Pretty dark. Rocky, Rocky's the only movie that I, I ever have ever cried in, like in like a serious way, like a man, a bro thing. Like when he's like when he's like all beat up and stuff at the end, and he's like Adrian, Adrian, like that. And he can't see or anything. Oh man, I mean, you're talking about buckets of tears, man. I'm I'm, I'm crying, and my wife thinks it's the funniest thing ever. She's like, why would you why would you cry over that? I'm like I don't know. I think it's I think it's freaking awesome. No Country for Old Men. That's another one. That's another one. I'll watch that every time. In fact, I have it like recorded on on YouTube TV. All right. Four days of of, of hell. I'm gonna run out of water. 
Can can my beavers actually die? I mean, this doesn't seem very very realistic, you know. I mean, are all my saplings gonna die? Okay, it's gonna die in in, in a few days. We'll we'll be fine. I've never looked it up. Was Christian Slater also playing Elvis in True Romance uh, when he talked to him in the bathroom? I think so. It's been a long time. The scene of the kid in the wheelchair falling off a cliff. Push, rather. What are you talking about? What is that? Mac? Is that Mac and me? I have no idea what that is. That does not sound like a like a like a great movie. Now the Big Lebowski, the scene where uh, where where they're giving the eulogy, and uh, decide to like throw the the uh, the ashes into the ocean, and it comes back down on on, on Lebowski. That was just classic. Oh, the coin flip flip scene is in old country, yeah. And and he in and what's his face? Um, Forget the guy's name. The main, the the not not the assassin, but the main character in that. He is just such a badass, and I hated that he died. I hated it. Now we are just going through the water, though. Fucking drought. I obviously don't understand this game very well. I feel like I've been, I've been in the same spot for like uh for a very long time. Brolin, that's it. Not Tommy Lee Jones. Tommy Lee Jones does a good job too, but Brolin um is so good in it. Well, at least we got food. We have no water. We got a day and a half left. Hope my beavers don't dry out. I can't remember if Brolin or, or Jones get, gets off in it. You're going to have to rewatch. Yeah, I won't tell you, Friedman, just for that. It's, but it's very sad. And the very end where the uh where the assassin hits a car and like and like ends up uh breaking his arm, his arms like all like coming out of the bones coming out. It's pretty gnarly. But that that's Cohen Brothers for you, man. They 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 do uh they do some pretty damn good stuff. I think they have a new movie coming out, don't they? What happened to my road here? Point four days, half a day left. Let's see if we can get this to minus fifteen. My beaver's well-being. Water storage is like such a serious thing, you know. Thank goodness. Are we going to get our dam done before uh, before the stream is over? Harvey A. Uh, Barton is the assassin. He was great in, in Mother with Jennifer Lo uh, Lawrence. Javier Air, man, he he did a really good job. He was really seriously insane. That that uh that that part where he like uh ends up um strangling the uh, cop to death is just crazy. And that one part where he like the guy's like, um, he, he he stops the guy and the guy's like trying to talk. And he's like, shh, sticks that thing right on his head.
All right, I need I need this stuff to happen pretty quick. Will they start chopping trees down now? Maybe? All right, we got all of our, our stuff done. Hopefully, they'll start cutting down trees. We need to build this dam. Now, I'm assuming that this is going to work. There's two. So far, so good. What's the... Uh, what's that one movie that ends up with the main character suddenly gets shot up in their car leaving a diner? Muppets Take Manhattan. Really? No way. I don't believe it. All right, I don't I have no idea what's going to happen once we build this dam, but we're going to build the dam anyway. Is it going to flood our, our area? That's the question. I mean, I, you would think that it might, right? make this the my number one work priority we need more water well that's kind of dark if that's the case Ian, you take care, man. Maybe I'll see you tomorrow. Maybe not. Now, if I block this all the way, what happens? I guess we're going to find out. What kind of water is that?
Now to drive beaver in the village. That's what happens. It looks like it's okay. Right, we should be able to start like doing like I guess like some some well being here. A rooftop terrace, we could do it like right here. Must be placed to tap to other buildings, okay? I wonder how it can do this. Can I maybe, uh... Do it like that, and then maybe build a, uh... Some stairs, maybe? There we go. I don't know what this dam has done. Has it done anything at all? It smells like seven layers that beaver eats Taco Bell. <laughs> cool. Let's uh, let, let's we'll, we'll we'll take advantage of this too. Let's uh. Cut tr some trees. Oh, wait a minute. I need to... Maybe I need to do... Uh, a wood guy. Right there. And we'll cut trees up here. Does our happiness getting getting any better? What what else do we need to do here? Well being. Let's see what else we can make our our, our people happy. We need a shower that unlocks it with fifty. A medical bed. Contemplation spot. We'll kind of play right, right next to the dam. We still don't have any power. I have no idea how this how this is supposed to work. On a river bank. Well, this is the river, isn't it?
Looks like we're going to have enough water this time around. And I probably need to do another warehouse right over here. How do we how do we handle this? Look, oh, we've turned this into just nothing but still water. Game up that little inlet. Okay. This right here. Beavers are doing okay considering that we we don't have any power, but I mean, I kind of feel like we're missing something. During drought, all that around that uh, inlet will stay green, so use that to your advantage. Ah, will it? I still don't really understand why this isn't, uh, why my power stuff isn't going. Did I put it over here? Did not mean to do that. Where my where where's my warehouses again? Power needs flowing water. Did you dam somewhere downstream? I didn't. It's all flowing. How can I... Um... Can I dam just a portion of it? And kind of speed it through? Maybe that might work. Like, if I ended up doing, like, let's see, maybe a levy. Like that. 
right? So if I build a levee, then that will force that water. And maybe did another levee, maybe right here. Like that. So it'll force the water to come, come around. Like that. How about that? You want to put the wheels in a section that's fairly straight aligned with the grid. E.g. In the, in the, at the curve at the bottom. Well, I can make this. We can, we can kind of make this. Uh, I mean, I think that that would be good, right? But saying it can't build, they can't build anything here. Build more paths or a new district. Hmm. Can't reach it. So how do I, how do I, how do I fix that? I'm just curious if I can do this. How's the no tutorial going? It's all right. It's all right. I mean, these these building games, I, I I've uh, I've gotten. I, I'm pretty. Oh, any planks for this? Well, shit. Motherfucking drought. All of a sudden, it looks like it's working. Little girl, what's happening? Yeah, we can get all the way across and maybe I can build up here and cover this section too. We're okay on water though. We have 220 water right now. Feeling good. 
Oh, I got a package at the door. Give me a second, y'all. Can I build stairs to it, you think? I wonder if I can. Maybe I can. The drought hasn't come yet, so... We'll see. Can I build stairs? We're going to see. It's actually a really good good idea. We'll see if it, if it works. I think we have enough water to get us by. I'm just kind of curious if it will work. Will it work or won't it? Really uh, giving me Rimworld vibes. It kind of, it kind of has Rimworld vibes. Um, kind of not. Um, there, there's no war crimes or anything like that, and there's not like any kind of, like Rimworld is just in a class of its own. I mean, this it makes sense if it's droughting. If it's drought, we could if we build this, then we can possibly. Uh, oh, I need four planks. All oh, the drought ended. How about that for craziness?
And that actually ended up working out okay for us. How about that for craziness? How's beaver down going? It's it's going all right. I'm just trying to figure out how to like make it see this thing. This thing quits on me. So I think what I need to do is I need to uh, go all the way across. We'll go ahead and just delete that. Um, we need to go all the way across, and then um come over here into this area so we can build on this what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to build like a levee that kind of comes this way all the way across and like forces the water that way but I don't know if it's going to work or not In America, all bu buses are uh, shorter to make room for uh, students who are wider. So see, if we can build this levee this way, I think we'll be in good shape. But I don't know if we're going to be able to do it. Because the problem is this right here. See, it like it, 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 it cuts up it cuts off this. Now I think that I can go as I build it'll it'll push out maybe? I don't know. Another big issue we have is is this just does not want to like it does not want to cross over.
I mean, I guess I can come all the way up here, right? Now, I wonder if I do my windmill. Do my windmill right here. How would that how would that work? Let's let's try that. I hate that. But I could do a dam. Okay, I got an idea. I got an idea. I know I know what I'm going to do. You have you have two that is, that is built on one side. Maybe you can build all the way over the first to open it up afterwards. I was thinking about like doing it right here, right? I'm trying to understand the power part of it all.
And what does the green thing stand for? Right here, maybe? Thanks for watching. Very nice. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I just don't know. If that's like a... platform I'm going to see if this will uh I don't know if this will work. I haven't figured out the power part of it all. What I'm really confused about, see this right here? Okay, they're, they're building the materials out, so we can maybe do levees over on this side.
So we're building this levee right here so we can we can walk over it. And I'm thinking that I can actually build like a uh like build a windmill right here. Let me see if this works. So this, this should, by building this, this levee, what it should do is it should, like, constrain the waters. That's what I'm guessing. Not 100% sure this is going to work, but I, I, I think that it will. How many homeless do I have? Free beds. I have two two free beds. That's good. Come on, baby. Do your job. You're welcome, Abba. Yeah, this is this is actually pretty interesting. I, I just haven't figured out the power thing. But we do have a dr drought approaching in three days. I'm hoping that I can get this all done. And then we can kind of... Uh... I might end up doing a, a levy on this side, too. And just trying to push the power as much as I can. Another levy right there. Right there. And that should do it.
We're not going to get through. The, the, the drought's going to come again, but that's all right. We have 222 water, so we're good on the water. Do the flow of the water as in the speed makes any difference? I think it does, Gremlin. That's that's the reason why I'm like levying everything off. I think it I think it it matters. It, it matters and you can you, you can speed stuff up pretty uh, pretty strongly. And we have two of them now. Where you put the water, uh, the wheel, the water wasn't moving. Yeah, I know, right? That's the, that's over here. I originally did this. This is just a tutorial. What I was hoping to do is like I'm doing a levee to where it like concentrates the water. So it speeds it up and then comes around. But that just obviously didn't work for me. So I, mean, I guess I could do a couple platforms over here. Of course, now the water, now, now the water runs. You can do that for right now. Saying it's too far from the district. I wonder if it's because I, I bet you I need to do another, uh, another levy right here. Right there. Let's see if that will work. Yeah, that works. The other thing I think you have to build all the way over and remove the uh, the pieces in in between after. Yeah, so like so like we can't get too far away from this, right? This is our town center. And as you can see, it, it kind of like the only way that we can, from what I've gathered, the only way that we can really impede on that is by uh, by building uh, these structures, these um, these levees and stuff to um, to bring over or platforms. But I need uh, lumber. And we just don't have any lumber right now, so. So if I can get lumber, which I need power for lumber, but what I'm hoping for is that this will like end up uh, taking care of things for us. It's done. Now we just gotta wait. Got two days of, uh, of drought.
I'm probably gonna have to get this game myself. I know, right? It's it's actually pretty fun, and like and like I said, this has gotten overwhelmingly positive reviews. It's it's still in early access, so it, it's uh like I think it's like twenty thousand uh, positive reviews, and I've started to like only pretty much play games that are that are overwhelmingly positive because I just really want that to be uh you know just to be a good experience for myself as well as you guys, you know. I'm gonna do a couple more levies over here. So hopefully this will work. It's getting there now. See if this water, uh, if it works. Here we go. Looks like it cut this off, though. Good deal. We got it. The other one's not working, but that's okay. We'll, we'll figure that out here in a, in a few as well. This one does work. It's a lot of problem solving, that's for sure. Okay, so we got our we, we got our path right here. We should that should come all the way up. Let's let's take a look. Yeah, that brings us up to here. What we can do is do another wood. Ch chopper right here, I guess. How do we okay so i guess this is will be another district i suppose is that how it works weird all right how do we set up districts Just woke up from a nice little 30-minute nap. 
Well, we, we got the power going. We figured that out. We can speed this through pretty quick. We might end up doing another dam over here. I think we can push this stuff pretty good. That's really weird. I wonder if I can do a pathway. There we go. Okay, that works. Beautiful. Okay, now we got it. How do we do this? I don't even know if that's possible. Let's see what happens. Uh oh, now comes the gerrymandering part of mandering part of the game. What? Grow the vegetables over here, and let's do a, a warehouse storage. Okay, so we, we, we can't really do much right here. That's fine. We, we, we've got that. We've got this. What does this say? Oh, it's flooded. What does that mean? We're going to lose that, but that's whatever. We're, we're, we're fine with losing that.
Hold on. We'll plant crops. It'd be cool to be factions of other animals. Uh oh, now comes a gerrymanding part of the game. We probably don't have enough workers. No available workers in the district. We got the gathering flag. Don't need to plant. Right, so I need more, uh, more people. See if, if we if we build more stuff, that there'll be more people. Let's see if the wooden stairs will we'll, we'll change that. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna see if if we build this, if I can go up. I, oh, you know what? Hold on. Right there. All right. How do I go up higher? Shift R. Okay, that's that. I know I was just trying to figure out like how to how to go up to the very top because it doesn't look like it's gonna let me get to the very uh
Tip top. Maybe just like that. I'm just curious if I can get more people in here. A lot of this is just me learning. That worked out real well. You could probably put another levy right there as well. Just like that. The Beaver Whisperer, indeed. Let's see if this little contraption will work for me. It didn't work. Son of a bitch. I mean, it looks like it should work, right? Well, when when you when you're uh, messed up like this, you just do it all over again, right?
I'm giving my beavers a way to get to get there. Pats on the platform should work. Yeah, you, you, let's see if it works. Still not working. Can we draw paths on the platform though? I don't think we can. Oh, wait a minute, I, I can. Oh, you're a genius. No, you're a genius drunk for listening to your drunk on life fam suggestions. I know. Well, I have to. I'm like completely dumb when it comes to a lot of this stuff. So, gotta figure it out as I go. You know. I might go ahead and also build a uh, another warehouse over here too. We're still waiting on workers. Ah, here we go. Shaxilla. What 
Well, I'll eventually have like we'll put we'll put grain in this one. That's wheat, so we need wheat. Now, I wonder how we can raise this to where it's actually working. The drought's not so bad. Well, guys, I think I'm done here. We'll stop. This this game is uh is called Timberborn. We might we might end up uh, revisiting this sometimes. It's overwhelmingly positive reviews, and it's it's gotten my attention. It really does. It's uh it, it's it's complicated enough to where you're kind of like scratching your head going what do i do what do i do how do i deal with this stuff um it's an early access still which means it'll only get better or it could get a lot worse who knows um because you know developers do that kind of stuff um tomorrow i'll probably be off i'm probably taking the day off to go to costco and do those kind of things um, um if i do if i'm if i'm here tomorrow i will be playing zomboid if i'm not here tomorrow i'll be playing zomboid on friday um, so there's that. Good game. Hey, Vaco, Vaco, Vaco. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Here comes the sun. Ba da 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 da. <laughs> I will uh, see you guys tom tomorrow or Friday. If not tomorrow, you can always join my Discord. You can join my Discord. I, I announce when I go live every day, every time I do that, about 10 to 15 to 20 minutes early. And, uh, yeah. Fun game. Fun game, you guys. Y'all have a, a safe and happy hump day, and I will see you guys on the flizz eye. Faux shizzle. I'm going to go and maybe do some house cleaning and then go to work.